I'm Sergeant Maggie Cox from the Phoenix Police Department's Public Affairs Bureau. This video includes information and video from an incident in our community where eight individuals were arrested during demonstrations. The incident happened outside Phoenix Police Headquarters at Washington Street and 7th Avenue, Sunday evening, August 9th. Demonstrators had blocked roadways in the area and eventually ended up in front of the building around 7 p.m. Fencing has lined the area since damage was done during the protests back in May. The group began shaking the fence, eventually toppling it, and moved into the restricted area. At this point, officers from the Tactical Response Unit established a line in front of the doors and then walked toward the crowd to move them out of the protected area. The group was warned over a loudspeaker to move off the property but did not. When officers attempted to arrest the violators, other members of the crowd attempted to hinder the officers from making the arrests. At this time, some demonstrators began retrieving items from backpacks on the ground across the street and began throwing items and assaulting officers. During the aggravated assaults on the officers, less lethal munitions were deployed, including pepper balls and spray, one stun bag, and a loud noise device known as Boar Thunder. An unlawful assembly was declared Approximately 10 minutes later, the crowd dispersed. A total of eight people were arrested on a variety of charges, including aggravated assault on a police officer, riot, and unlawful assembly. There were no injuries requiring treatment from the fire department. This video was intended to inform and educate the public about a critical incident in our community. You can learn about the Phoenix Police Department's transparency policy on our website.